From the introduction of a one-inch sensor to possible integration with Garmin and Apple smartwatches, the Osmo Action 6 could represent a leap forward not just for DJI, but for the entire category. For years, GoPro and Insta360 have dominated the conversation, with DJI often seen as the challenger. But if recent leaks surrounding the upcoming DJI Osmo Action 6 hold true, that dynamic could be about to shift in a major way. One of the most intriguing rumors is the potential for deep smartwatch integration, particularly with Garmin and Apple devices. The Osmo Action 5 Pro already allowed for basic overlays of speed, heart rate, and distance, but the Action 6 could go much further. According to leaks, smartwatches might serve as remote controllers, enabling recording start-stop, mode switching, and even framing feedback directly from the wrist. For athletes who cannot easily reach their mounted camera, think cyclists, divers, or snowboarders, this could be a major usability improvement. The integration also seems poised to expand the data ecosystem available for overlay. With Garmin, for instance, users might be able to record power, cadence, pace, or dive data, all synchronized and embedded into their footage in real time. This would transform the Osmo Action 6 into more than a camera. It would become an analytics tool for athletes and trainers. If DJI manages to extend compatibility to watches beyond Garmin and Apple, the feature could appeal to a broad user base, from triathletes to casual adventurers. The rumored specifications suggest DJI is aiming to outpace both GoPro, Hero 13 Black, and Insta360 Ace Pro 2 in meaningful ways. Neither competitor currently offers a 1-inch sensor in a compact body, and 8K recording is still absent from their lineups. GoPro continues to emphasize its mature, hyper-smooth stabilization and ecosystem of accessories, while Insta360 leans heavily on creative 360-degree capture. DJI seems to be carving its niche around sensor performance, pro-level video specs, and smartwatch integration. Three areas that could resonate strongly with creators who value image quality and efficiency over gimmicks. Pricing will play a decisive role. Early speculation places the Osmo Action 6 between $329 and $429, which is aggressive for a camera with these capabilities. If DJI can deliver the rumored features while holding that price range, it could dramatically undercut GoPro's flagship while offering a more professional toolkit. Perhaps the most significant rumor about the Osmo Action 6 is its move to a 1-inch CMOS sensor. In camera design, sensor size directly influences image quality, particularly in challenging lighting. Larger sensors gather more light, which means better detail in shadows, smoother gradients in highlights, and overall superior dynamic range. The Action 5 Pro shipped with a 1-slash-1.3-inch sensor, a respectable size for an action camera, but it was still constrained compared to what DJI uses in other product lines. By stepping up to 1 inch, DJI is positioning the Action 6 as the first action camera capable of producing results that approach compact professional systems. The expected 13.5 plus stops of dynamic range would be a major advantage for creators who work in uncontrolled environments. Whether filming at dawn, in forests, or underwater, action cameras must deal with harsh contrasts and quick shifts in lighting. A larger sensor, combined with DJI's color science, could mean footage that requires less correction in post-production. DJI has already proven what this sensor size can do in its Osmo Pocket 3 and Mini 5 Pro drone, both of which earned praise for their sharpness and low-light handling. Translating that into an action camera could be transformative. Beyond still image improvements, the Osmo Action 6 is rumored to push video capabilities further than any of its rivals. The headline spec is 8K video at 30 frames per second, which, if confirmed, would make it one of the first action cameras to offer true 8K capture. While some will argue that 8K is overkill, especially since few consumers own 8K displays, professionals value the extra resolution for editing flexibility. Cropping, reframing, and applying stabilization in post can all be done without noticeable loss of detail. More practical for most users, however, 
is the reported support for 5.3K at 60 frames per second and 4K at 120 frames per second. These modes strike a balance between resolution and frame rate, with 5.3K delivering a sharp master file and 120 frames per second opening the door to smooth cinematic slow motion. The ability to record at 1080p 240fps ensures that even extreme slow motion sequences are possible, something athletes and content creators regularly demand. Color science is also becoming a battleground in the action cam world, and DJI seems ready to compete with 10-bit D-Log M and flat color profiles. These features are crucial for professional editors who need flexibility when color grading. Shooting in a flat profile preserves detail across highlights and shadows, making it easier to adapt footage to different creative styles or match other cameras in a multi-camera setup. Stabilization is one of the most defining aspects of an action camera, and DJI's rumored upgrade to Rocksteady 4.0 with AI-enhanced Horizon. Steady 360 degree shows its determination to lead. Rocksteady has already proven itself on earlier models, but the introduction of AI into the stabilization process suggests smarter correction of motion. Horizon Steady 360 degree is especially notable. If the leaks are accurate, it means the Action 6 could maintain a level horizon even if the camera spins completely. For action sports where rolling movements are inevitable, this could eliminate the need for external gimbals. While exact dimensions are still unclear, it seems DJI is prioritizing performance over compactness. Importantly, early reports suggest the Action 6 will retain the rugged waterproof design of its predecessor with an impressive 18 to 20 meters of waterproofing without a case. That puts it on par with or ahead of current competitors. One curious specification is the rumored 47 gigabytes of built-in storage. The number may appear arbitrary, but it mirrors DJI's marketing pattern from the Action 5 Pro, which used 47 megapixels as a signature photo spec. Built-in storage isn't meant to replace micro SD cards, but it provides a safety net something professionals appreciate when a card fails or is forgotten. Connectivity also looks to be future-proofed. Bluetooth 5.1 and Wi-Fi 6 promise faster pairing and transfer speeds, while USB-C video out opens the door to direct streaming or external recording. Though it may not support full display port functionality, the inclusion of video output is another step toward making the Action 6 more versatile beyond traditional action shooting. Dual OLED touchscreens are also expected, giving users the ability to frame from both the front and rear, which is now a must-have feature for vloggers. Battery life remains a sticking point for most compact cameras, but the Osmo Action 6 may manage to hold steady despite its more powerful internals. A 1950 mAh cell is rumored, with endurance quoted at over 4 hours of 4K recording. Regardless, if DJI maintains 4K endurance in the 4-hour range, it will remain highly competitive with GoPro and Insta360.